we're in Vegas. So if there's a city to be fully energized and fully motivated in, it's this city right here. So speaking of, uh, I think uh, I think the city, you know, little lady luck is a creep off the tables, onto the lanes, rub a few bald men's head on the way through, and it's going to walk past a bunch of poker machines, just rubbing bald men's heads everywhere. Okay, that was uh, that was a good match with with Sean. Um, he's got the uh, the last win against me, the last time we played in a heads up match. So uh, I knew he was going to be a really tough opponent, and he struck out in the second game to not only reduce my lead but to, to give a lead to himself. So we had to do something different. I was throwing the ball great, the ball was hitting the pocket um, enough, it just couldn't strike. And so um, I had a chat with Timmy. We decided to go with an attention star, a different one with just a little bit more surface, just to read that mid lane, just so it didn't want to go too long before it made the curve. Um, and that was the difference. I didn't move my feet, didn't change my hand, just changed the ball with a little bit more surface. Got it uh, rolling to the pins really, really nice. So, whew, all right, we're still alive. Just keep on rolling them, I guess.
That's it. Oh, you no. just came all the way over just to. What team are you on? Check for him. Yeah, I did. Oh, you bought. When's this happening? I bought tomorrow. Tomorrow. Yeah. All right. Good luck. Thanks. Play well. You too. I wish you the best. Is this good? Look good. All right. So we just got done with the Tyler Cortez Shank match, and um, first off, like 25-year-old kid, he's pretty amazing. I mean, he's he's been bowling so well so young and so good it's pretty scary actually the next gen of bowlers coming through how good they are uh, and so that was the second time I've ever seen uh, bowled against Tyler we bowled against each other heads up for the players championship a few years ago and he needed a strike to beat me there and I think he four pinned so he's pushed me both times that we've we've played and tonight was was no different um I gotta stop missing spares. I just gotta stop doing that. And it's just, it's just a break of concentration. It's me thinking about the next move that I'm gonna do with the next ball, and I'm just, I'm not respecting that, that shot enough. So, no more of that. Um, yeah. Other than that, I bowled a lot of really, really good shots. A couple of careless ones here and there, but. Um, you know, the next round is going to be, it's going to be very interesting. There's Sam Cooley, uh, Richie Teese, EJ Tackett, and myself. Four bowlers left. We all bowl together. We all bowl three games. And only the top three of the four make it to the television show. So it's, um, it's about getting off to a good start. And it's about making really good ball changes. Because now we're going to see a completely different transition with the four of us on a pair rather than just two of us on a pair. So, yeah, I'll have my thinking cap on, make sure I make some good shots, one more really good set, and we're on TV.
bunch of different lanes and then in that uh, final match I just bowled so well through the middle I just you know when I had a chance to really get an extra few pins especially in that first game and that second game I took full advantage of it we're getting the last six in the first game I, mean, I missed another spare I can't but I cannot believe it what am I doing I'm very glad it didn't cost me but yeah, then we doubled out in the second game and then got off to a really good start in the third game until the lanes just kind of exploded and blew up and I'd got enough pins by then, so I'm extremely thrilled. Um, looking forward to being the third seed for the Masters, looking forward to win my fifth Masters. Fingers crossed, it's gonna be, uh, it's gonna be fun. The road to the Masters. Now you know just how hard it is just to make the show. The job's not done. I got a couple more games to go. Let's get it. G'day, thanks for watching. If you loved this one, check out the rest of the videos from this playlist or any other playlist. Make sure that you like the video and please subscribe if you would love to be the first to catch any of the latest of the behind the scenes and a whole lot of other cool stuff.